Hi Paul, this is Jay, hope you're okay today. Uh, it's good to see you and uh, just making a quick video, uh, just a, a little observation about modern atheism today. Uh, particularly about uh, the people on the Magic Sandwich show um, and Aaron Ra as well. And, and that is this, is that it's quite evident to me and it's been evident for a long, long time that these people lack education. Um, that goes right down to Dawkins, um, Sam Harris, um, and um, to people like Theoretical Bullshit, Bionic Dance. They really do lack education because real education um, is cultured, engages with culture, engages with a wider culture. But these people can't engage in a wider culture because they're pathologically um, schizophrenically always wanting to bash Christianity and like I said it's pathological it's bearing, it's bearing on uh, the psychotic and um, it's a shame really it's a shame that they don't talk about novels such as Ian Foster's uh, writings or Virginia Woolf or or uh, a Kafka or or something like that but instead they're just these moronic Jeremiah almost on crack cocaine atheist addicts who go around bashing Christianity um, the crack cocaine being that they get a buzz of bashing Christianity I don't say that they take crack cocaine literally but like they they're just like drugged up on this desire to attack Christ, the Christian faith, and and it's just a lack of education, really. Um, basically, the the children that haven't grown up, that's the problem with Dawkins and Aaron Ra, the people on the Magic Sandwich Show. They're just kids that haven't grown up. They're not mature. They lack a maturity in the in the way they handle themselves on the show uh, and Aaron Ra shows a lack of maturity the way he handles himself uh, and it's a shame really so I just hope they start to get a bit of an education I hope they start to read a bit more widely and learn to know what real education is really uh, those are my thoughts really That that that's what I get out of listening to uh, the Magic Sandwich show last night and listening to the atheist over two years it's a shame I mean there are one or two people who are educated and are cultured atheists but these people that have put themselves up as, as leaders of or as defenders of freedom um, on behalf of atheism um, they're totally uneducated really um, if you go on the front page of this channel, you'll see Professor Ward, and he'll give he'll give you an understanding in a deeper way of what I'm trying to say. All right, thank you for listening, and you atheists out there, I know it's hard for you to take. I know it's a shock to you. You know, I know it's very hard for you to accept that the main people who were speaking on your behalf are uneducated, but you'll get used to it. Just think it through. Uh, and you really get used to it uh, and when you see that how uneducated they are you know you you'll be a better